All right, all right, all right, all right. All right, so I'm trying to figure out what's the best like way to make videos in this room. So I'm going to be having different angles, different positionings, and just see like what's the, you know, best type of background. You know, I got like a little plain white wall right there that I can do. I got my little corner right here. I got the TV. But right now, this is my other channel. Make sure y'all subscribe to my other channel, Damn D P O V, Damn D Point of View. And this is the reaction that I made on that uh, game three. No, yeah, game. Was it game three? Yeah, game three of Dallas and the Clippers with Luca. Woo! That boy is the truth, man. That boy, that boy is the truth. So this is my uh, other channel. So make sure y'all subscribe to my gaming to my other channel if y'all want to see reactions of me just re reacting to everything sports entertainment movies other youtubers trending topics hip-hop gossip it's, it's just me reacting to everything out there in the world so make sure y'all go click the link to that damn deep pov but today we got an unbox man y'all y'all let me know how y'all like this angle you know what I'm saying? Is, is this a good angle? I don't know. We're going to see once I edit the video. But hopefully this is a good angle. This is a good look. But anyway, um, I got a pair of shoes, man. This is a grail. A grail, man. This is a grail to me. This is a shoe I could not. I, I had to cop this, bro. This was an automatic cop. No questions. Bro, give me my size 11 and a half. I need it. Um, here's my credit card. Swipe and dike. You know what I'm saying? A grill, a grill, a grill shoe. And this shoe, I think it's, if it's not sold out by now, it's slowly selling out. But these are definitely going to sell out if it if it hasn't already sold out. But um, this is a shoe, this is a shoe that I grew up on. This is a shoe of one of my favorite basketball players of all time. And uh, I already have one pair of shoe, but I didn't know that it was a difference until I bought the shoe and I opened it up. I was like, oh shit, these are completely two different shoes. Because I was going to sell this one, which is on the ground, because that's the wrong size, but I just took the insole out and I could still wear it. So I'm going to keep that shoe and I'm going to keep this shoe, but y'all going to see. This is one of the goats, one of the goats of all time, one of the greatest, especially one of the best, if not the best, probably the best, the best small shooting guard of all time, the best small man in the NBA, the most iconic, legendary, game shifting, game changing, one the best crossover of all time, the man that made the NBA change dress code. The man that shook the NBA culture and brought hip hop culture into the NBA. The man that started the braids. The man that started everybody getting tattoos. The man, the legend, the myth himself. AI, baby. Allen Iverson, man. And this is a. I remember. When this shoe came, I, I remember everything, bro. It's it's crazy when like old school shoes like this comes comes re retro. You you can honestly just like remember events and remember going to the store. You can remember what outfits you had on. You know what I'm saying? It's it's just crazy how you know shoes can just bring you back in time. But this is a shoe, bro. It's a grill. It's a grill to me. It's not all about the hype. It's not all about, oh, uh, is it a $1,000 shoe? Is it a $2,000 shoe? I don't care about that. This is what I love about the sneaker game. Shoes like this that just mean so much to you. And I dropped the box. What am I talking about? Hopefully I'm in the frame. Because it looks like I'm kind of off. And I'm going to show y'all the differences because there is differences between this version 
and the version that's on the ground. So I'm going to show y'all the differences. But the goat, the 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 best small man of all time in the NBA, my favorite player of all time, Allen Iverson. As y'all know, my favorite players of all time is Iverson, Jordan, and Kobe. We got the 2020 Red Toe Questions. Woo! Now, like I said, I have the original, well not the original, but the, I'm going to show y'all the difference, all right? Because I didn't know that there was a difference until, until I got the shoe and I was like, oh shit, these are two different shoes because there's a lot of just little subtle differences that make me want to keep this shoe and make me want to keep that shoe because I was going to sell this one, right? This is this is my other pair, right? Y'all probably looking like, bruh, it's the same shoe. Ah, to the naked eye. But once you get up and close in details, I'm going to show y'all the difference. So let me get behind that camera and let me show y'all, all right? Huh? Let me get the table over here. Let's see. Let's see if I can do this on the table. One take, Jake. I'm not editing this. Alright. Oh, this is bad. This is bad lighting right here. Y'all can't see. Uh, well. Yeah, you can. Alright, good. Alright. So, this is... No, you can't see. No, you can't. No, you can't. Alright. Let me turn it this way. Bring this table over here. Man. There we go. Yeah. Okay, there you go. Now we can see. Yeah, you can see. All right. Right off the rip. Back that up a little bit. Right off the rip. This one is the 2020. This one is. What year did this come out? This one came out, I forgot, what, I think this was maybe like three or four years ago. Three or four years ago, okay? But the main difference between these is the toe. Look at the toe. That one is leather, this one is leather, and this one is suede. I didn't know that this shoe was suede until I bought the shoe. So as you see, this one got a, a leather toe box. And this one has a suede on that bad boy. And the suede is nice on here, too. So the toe box is different. Leather. Boom. Suede. Boom. Check out the laces. Mmm. Check out the laces. This one has a little, you know, little... Is it black or blue dots? It's blue dots. They have blue dots on the shoe. Uh, as you see. And the other ones do not have a blue dot. It's just a regular white shoelaces, right? Boom. Now, let's check the tongue. Wow. Y'all see the difference in the tongue? The difference in the tongue is this one has a blue outline. The newer version, the 2020 version, has a blue outline. And the, let's just say 2000, I don't know, 16 <laughs> version doesn't have the blue line. All right. Check out the side. Uh, let's put that one. Bam. Check out the side. All right. This one, as you see, also has the blue outline on the Reebok. This one doesn't. Yes, she, yes, she, yes, she. So there's a little, little difference here and there that makes this shoe the same but different at the same damn time. And as you see, another difference is this has like little white Spider-Man, little cobwebs right there. 
and this one doesn't this one just has clear it's just clear there's no white you know highlights on it if y'all can see it y'all see it right there boom shakalaka so you can see the differences between the shoes so I'm gonna keep both pairs I'm gonna keep both pairs I was gonna sell this one because this is a size 11 and if you buy Iversons, get go a half size up. Go a half size up because my true to size is 11, but this 11 is snug as fuck. But I just took the insole out, and it fits pretty good, you know. So if your Iversons uh, run a little snug, just just take the insole out, and you'll be good to go, man. But this is my older pair, and this is the new pair with that suede on it, with that suede, man. So. Definitely, I'm keeping both pairs clean. I had to have this shoe, bro. This is just a classic. This is a grill to me, and I love it, man. But other than that, it's your boy, Damn D. Oh, yeah, same thing on the back, too. Check out the back. This is suede, and this is leather. Check out the three. The three has a blue outline, and this one does not. So, just a little subtle differences just like that but they both dope they both clean and i'm keeping all of my pairs so other than that man it's your boy damn d hit that like button man and all my true Iverson fans y'all better cop this this is a grill this is a must cop other than that it's your boy damn d i'm signing out baby peace